The Install Plugins screen is where you manage plugins. This screen lists all the plugins, both active and inactive, that are in the WP Content Plugins folder. Once a plugin is installed, you can activate it, deactivate it, delete it, edit the settings, or upgrade the plugin from the screen. The default WordPress install comes with two inactive plugins already installed. Ask Kimmet for comment spam control and Hello Dolly for fun. Thousands of additional plugins can be found in the WordPress plugin repository at WordPress.org. This screen is a table of the installed plugins in alphabetical order with a separate plugin on each line. This table has the plugin name with links to activate or deactivate, edit and delete, and settings if needed to configure the plugin, and a description that tells what the plugin does along with the version number, the author's link, and the plugin site link. If you have a lot of plugins to manage, then at the top of this screen are links that list only the active, inactive, or the recently active plugins, and a search box that searches your installed plugins. Also at the top of the plugins page is the screen options tab. Click on this tab and a drop down panel will activate. You can hide the descriptions column by unselecting this box, or you can limit the number of plugins that are listed in the table. Click the Screen Options tab again to close this panel. The Bulk Action feature is also available if you need to perform any action on several plugins at once. Select the plugins and the action and click the Apply button. All newly installed plugins are inactive by default and must be activated to work and some may require some configuration to operate properly.